What's up fam, we are back again with another tutorial and today we'll be making a Kodak black type beat, you know, something similar to Senseless and as you already know, we'll be dropping the FLP for free so make sure you watch the video to the end to get a password for the zip file. So let's get to the tutorial. So this tutorial, the melody are going to be, you know, kind of like plenty. So let's start building, let's start building it. So I'll be starting with my, um, the, the roots and my key is in D sharp minor. So let's start building the chord progression. So let me bring it down an octave, then we listen to how it sounds. First, let me drag it, then let me reduce the volume. Now let's listen to how it sounds. Okay, I like the way it's, I like how it's sounding. Now let's, um, you know, let's work on the other chord progressions. Okay, I like the way this one is going. So let me let me just stretch everything, then we'll strum it. Okay, now let's let's um, let's go and work on the piano. Okay, I like the way it's sounding. So let me just um, copy to the other side and let's see if we can make something there. So let's listen to how it sounds first. Okay, it's actually in key. So I thought maybe because the, the chord, the second chord of the rose dropped, um, it will sound different from, you know, the piano, but it sounds cool. So let's, um, let's work on the bells. So let me just copy the, the piano's um, chord progression. Then let me paste it at the bells. So this is the only instrument that is third party uh, plugin, but it's a free plugin. So you can get your hands on it. It's DSK music box. So let's listen to how it sounds. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll just, um, I'll bring this one here. Now let's listen to how it sounds. Okay, I like it. I like it. It's, it's dope. So now let's move on to the, uh, the flute. Okay, so let me bring this one here. Now let's check it out. Okay, so I like the way that one, I like how that one is sounding, but let me uh, change the first one. Okay, I like the way, I like how it's sounding. So let me raise it up an octave. Let's check something out. Okay, I like it, but I want to change the first melody. Okay, let's just keep it simple, like the way the piano melody is playing. So let's raise it up an octave. Now let's check it out. Okay. 
Okay, I like the way it's, I like how it's sounding. Now let's um, start working on the bass. Okay, so let me bring it down an octave. Okay, I like I like it this way rather. Okay, so the bass is only going to be at that side, then we will work on the 808. Okay, I like I like how it's sounding. So let's start fixing in the um the claps. Okay, now let's start working on the percussion. I like the way it's sounding, so let me copy it to the other side. So now let's start working on the hi hat. So let me fill in the two steps. Let me take it to the piano roll, then let's start editing. Okay, so let me copy this one to the other side then let's fix in some low notes here so let me go to the um this magnet tool here then let me choose half step uh one third step then let me do some rows here then let me move it from the grade a little bit so i'll hold alt then let me shift it now let's listen to how it sounds <laughs> like it i like the way it's sounding so let's let's fix in the open hearts Okay, so let me let me do some rows here you wouldn't hear it but let me uh, put an envelope on it then you will start hearing it so the envelope now let's listen to how it is sound <laughs> Yep, I like the way they are sounding. So we've forgotten one thing, which is the kicks. So let's bring in the kicks. So let me take off all the instruments. Let me leave the bass and the 808. Then we're fixing the kicks. Okay, let's go. Let's listen to it with the melodies.
okay i like the way it's sounding i'm done with the tutorial you know when you end up using this flp please give credit you know and if you like you can change some sounds and i'm pretty sure it will be sounding dope you know these sounds are too cheap they are sounding too cheap apart from the drums you know so hope you learned something see you in the next tutorial peace out